Okay, so let's try, let's try this. It says, um, what is the mass of mercury produced, so mercury is Hg, produced from the decomposition of 1.25 grams of orange mercury 2 oxide, okay? So, we've got the mass of mercury 2 oxide and we want the mass of mercury, okay? So what's the first thing we need to do? Molar mass. Yeah, we got to use the molar mass of what? Of grams to moles. Grams to moles of mercury to oxide, you're saying, right? Right? Yes. right? To convert it to moles, right? Yes. Okay, so did, has anybody calculated that molar mass yet? Is anybody, what is it? 216.59. Uh huh, so 216.59. So where would we put that number? The On the bottom. 216.59, and I like to put grams of mercury to oxide. What would we put on the top? One mole. One mole of mercury to oxide. Okay, so look what we have now. We've got moles of mercury to oxide. Is that the mass of mercury? No. No, no. So not what yet. is? Not yet. We're going to get there. Yeah, very good. So what's the next thing we're going to do? So another step, right? So multiply by what? Molar ratio. Okay, what molar ratio? What's going to be on the bottom? Uh, two moles. Okay, two, two moles. Hydrogen. Um, sorry. Of what? Mercury, mercury oxide. Mercury, mercury oxide. oxide. Mercury two oxide. Yeah. Okay, and at the top? Two moles of mercury. Two moles of mercury. Very good. Okay, so let's cancel and see where we're at now. We're at moles of mercury. Is that the same as mass of mercury, ladies? Is that the same? Mass and moles, is it the same? No, not on. No, it's not. So what do we have to do to convert from moles to mass? Molar mass. The molar mass, yeah. That thing, right? So the molar mass of what though? Mercury. Mercury. Right? Well where will we get that from? The periodic table. And what does it tell us? We look up there and it says two hundred. 200.59, and where are we going to put it, on the bottom or on the top? The top. 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 200.59. Very good. Grams of mercury. And on the bottom? One mole of mercury. One mole of mercury. Cancel, cancel. Grams of mercury. Is that the mass of mercury? Yes. Wonderful. So we're there. Okay, so let's just calculate this. So. 1.25 divided by 216.59 times 200.59. And I get to three significant figures, 1.16 grams of mercury. Is everybody okay doing something like that? Yes. Okay, wonderful. So you got to remember step by step by step. If you're doing the wrong steps in the wrong order, you're not going to get these um, problems right. The other thing is we've been having balanced chemical equations given to us. So we got to remember if it's unbalanced to balance it first, okay?